Hi, Gillian Sutherland, Director of Ray White Projects. Thanks for joining me again for our July e-news. This month, I'll be talking about the Gold Coast new development cycle and why right now there's some excellent buying opportunities for institute purchases. Here on the Gold Coast, we're at the start of a new development phase, one that's underpinned by strong fundamentals, including the city's population growth and hosting of the 2018 Commonwealth Games. We're working with numerous developers who are either progressing or planning new projects on the Gold Coast, ranging from private families to national and large-scale international developers. Right now, as an example, there's five development sites undergoing due diligence through our agency. These projects are coming to the market at a time when the existing stock of new apartments is starting to dry up. For example, there's just a few apartments left at, say, Oracle at Broadbeach. That diminishing supply means there's quite a bit of pent-up demand, and as a result we're seeing projects coming to the market that are geared to residential use rather than for tourism purposes. This coincides with the baby boomer generation entering retirement and changing their housing needs. Retirees are gravitating towards new apartments as part of their downsizing phase, and they tend to stay or be drawn to the coast because of its lifestyle appeal. Another strong demographic is Asian buyers who are complementing locals and absorbing new stock as it comes to the market. Driven by China-based investors, this market was responsible for absorbing a lot of built stock over the last few years, and their momentum shows no signs of slowing down. Unlike in years past, the Gold Coast is shielded from oversupply issues. Banks and developers are more financially conservative. The apartments and the projects are generally smaller. We're not seeing any super high-end high-rise product like the Hilton or Seoul. They're mostly between 50 and 200 apartments per building and designed more for residential use. There are some excellent buying opportunities for savvy purchasers who want to jump into the market while it's still in the early stages of a rising cycle. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you again next week. I'm Julian Sutherland. Bye for now.